I'm gonna do a video on mom hacks. So guys, I have six. <laughs> I have six mom hacks for you guys today that I have recently figured out and I have been trying all of them and they all work pretty good for me and I still use all of them. And so I hope these will also help you guys make your life a little bit easier when you have toddlers and babies. So let's go check it out. Does this always happen? Try this. The cut in the tag is actually really useful. Wrap it around the handle of your cup and stick it back on the string. Then, when you pour in the water, it's locked and it isn't going anywhere. Burp cloths can be annoying. Try this. Use a bib so that your baby's clothes stay nice and dry. When my baby would sleep in his cradle, he always would lose his soother and it would fall right down there. So annoying. Then I figured out this. If your cradle has hooks, it's perfect. Also, if it doesn't, try one of these plastic hooks that stick to the wall. It's perfect for a soother holder. Too many bags and nowhere to put them? I got this at the dollar store and it works really good. It holds all the bags and it's nice and organized. And the door closes perfect. Have a blanket area on the couch for baby. Your baby is nice and close and your couch is safe and clean. Plastic bins for organized toy area is a really good idea and all his little toys are tucked nicely away under the TV stand. And these bins are just from the dollar store and it makes your house nice and clean. And it's easy for toddlers to pull it all out and get crazy. Too many bibs and nowhere to store them? Your high chair is perfect. On the back of it, put a wire hanger and look, easy. You just hook it on the bar if you have one and kind of just kind of jam it in there and it just stays and it's a really good spot to put it. You just unattach it, slip it through and reattach and then it's a nice organized place. So today this is the last mom hack I have for you guys. All you do is take some tape and air fresheners from the dollar store. It comes with two. So what we're going to do is put it on the top of a garbage can lid. You tape it on with the tape and if you're tired of smelly garbage, it's perfect because every time you open the garbage can, you get a whiff of fresh air instead of garbage nastiness. Also, you can do the same with a bathroom garbage can, and it works just the same. These are really cheap. It was about, I think, $2 for... Guys, thank you for watching. I hope you guys liked this video. Um, I hope it helps you guys. It makes it a little bit easier if you have kids, or even if you don't have kids, for some of the hacks. So guys, I am so sorry but I only have a phone right now to do my videos. I don't have a very good camera because like, that's not really realistic right now for me when my husband's going to be going to school soon and I'm a stay at home mom. So right now, that is not realistic for me to have a nice, good camera, but I am working on that. So if you guys can just be patient with me um, soon, my videos will be better quality, which will be really good for both of us. And so, bye guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did, um, like it so that I know you liked it. Let me know what videos you guys like the most so I can make more. And please subscribe if you like this channel because I could use some more subscribers.